G'day, Nick Bowditch here. Today I am just reminded of um, how grieving and mourning over um, a broken or, or lost relationship, not necessarily romantic relationship, just, just relationships in general, how sometimes that can really, really, really affect our ability to ever relate um, in a healthy way to someone else again. And, and you know, I've I, I worked with some people and, and know some people who try or are trying so hard not to be hurt again that they actually have succeeded in not being able to love again, right? Not, 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 that, they're not, been, not that they're not able to be loved, but not able to actually give that love. And, and I think it's a sad kind of thing when someone or something leads you to a point where you feel so broken and so unable to risk again, unable to take that step again, that, you know, we miss out on some pretty cool shit and some pretty good things happening in our life may never actually happen in our life because of what has happened previously in our life. And I just really support you to remember if you are going through that moment right now where, where you know somebody has let you down, where somebody has broken you, where somebody has, you know, hurt you to a point where you determined you where you're determined not to be hurt again, that you might just be becoming determined not to not to love again and, and I think that's a shame. I think the world needs your love. It needs that kindness. It needs that understanding, that empathy, that inclusion. Um, and I think we need it. You know, and I, I, I would hate to think that any one person or any one thing or one event in my life um, stops me from ever attracting or being attracted to somebody who else, somebody else in my life who might bring some really good share and I'm going to miss it because of the bitterness that I hold about one particular person or one particular event. You know, uh, I hope that nobody holds that kind of power over me anymore. I hope that nobody holds that kind of power over you. I hope that you never find yourself in a position where you can't find love in your heart, where you can't where you're not able to love um, because you could be potentially missing out on some really good shit. Thought for today. Have a great day, everyone. See ya.